Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw a terracotta warrior from China. So I'm going to take two fingers over here on the left and I'm going to put a dot. And from that dot I'm going to draw a slightly curved line up, down, and stop. Come back to the dot, slightly curved line up, down, connect. I come back over here on the left and I'm going to draw a curved line up, over, connect. I'm going to come back to the left and I'm going to draw a curved line down, curved line up, connect. Come over here, curved line up, down, in, connect. And then a little curved line up, over, connect. I come right here in the center and I'm going to put straight line, curve line, curve line, curve line, straight line up. I come on the left hand side and I'm going to draw a curve line out, back, connect on the left, curve line up, down, back, and connect. Come right back to the left, draw a big curve line out back, up, connect, little curve line inside. Come on the right hand side, curve line up, out, back, connect, and put another curve line inside. Okay, I come back on the inside down here in the center and I'm going to draw a curve line down, curve line up, connect on the left, Come on the right, curve line down, curve line up, connect on the right. I'm just going to draw a curve line, connect in the center, straight line, connect in the center, curve line up, down, connect on the right. Come over here on the left hand side and we're just going to draw a curve line down, up, connect on the left. Curve line down, up, connect on the right. Okay. Starting right here on the left, I draw a wavy, wavy line down, wavy, wavy line up, connect. Come back to the left. I'm going to draw a straight line down, slightly curved line over, jump over, slightly curved line, straight line, up, connect. If you have room, come over on the left and just draw slightly curved line off the page on the left, slightly curved line off the page on the right. Okay. Come over here on the left and just go one, two, three curved lines on the left. Come on the right. One, two, three curved lines on the right. Come over on the left and we're just going to go curve line, curve line, curve line, straight diagonal. Come back up, curve line, curve line, curve line, connect. Come on the right hand side. Curve line, curve line, straight diagonal. Come on this side, curve line, curve line, curve line, connect. If you have room, little baby circle. Curve line out, in, connect, little baby circle, curve line out, in, connect. Okay. Now, we're going to come over here and we're going to do a dot. And from that dot, we're going to draw a curve line down, leave it floating, come back up on the right, curve line down, connect. Come down, no, let's come up to the top and draw our curve line over, connect. Come over here on the left, curve line down, curve line up, connect. Little curve line, little curve line, connect. Come on the left, 
curve line down, up, connect on the left, curve line down, up, connect on the right. Come over to the left and we're just going to go wavy, wavy line down, wavy, wavy line up. Come back to the left, straight line, slightly curved line, jump over, straight line up, little curved line, little curved line off the page. And let's do some baby circle, baby circle, baby circle, baby circle baby circle. Okay, come back inside. We're going to draw a curve line, curve line back, connect on the left, curve line, curve line back, connect on the right. Come underneath, curve line, <clears throat> excuse me, curve line up, connect on the left, curve line, curve line up on the right. Little curve line inside, inside. Come right here in the center, straight line, curve line, curve line, straight line up, underneath, curve line down, up, connect, curve line down, up, connect, straight line across, straight line across. Okay, now come up here, put a dot, we're going to draw a curve line down, over, come back to the dot, curve line down, over, connect. Come down here at the bottom, wavy line, wavy line, wavy line, wavy line, up. Come back to the left, straight line down, curve line over, jump over, straight line, straight line, connect. On the left hand side, slightly curved line, come on the right, Curve line off the page. We're going to do baby circle, baby circle, baby circle. Baby circle, baby circle. Curve line, curve line, straight diagonal. Curve line, curve line, connect. Curve line, curve line, straight diagonal. Curve line, curve line, connect. If you have room, baby circles down baby circles now. Okay? Come back up here, right where the dot was, come on and do a curve line down, curve line up, connect on the left, little curve line, bigger curve line, down, up, connect on the right. Come over here on the left, curve line down, up, connect on the left, curve line down, up, connect on the right. Come right here on the inside and do a curve line down, curve line over, connect. Come on the left, curve line up, curve line down, connect. On the left, curve line up, curve line down, over, connect on the right. Curve line out, in on the left, curve line out, in on the right. Little curve line, little curve line. In the center, straight line, curve, 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 straight line up. Right underneath, curve line down, up, connect. Curve line down, up, connect. In the center, right here, straight line, slightly curved line. Okay, now back here, we're just gonna write, draw Circles, circle, 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 and then we're going to add curve line, curve line, put another circle, we're filling this in, put another circle, and I think another curve line. Okay, let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, I picked this because this is foreground, middle ground, and background. And uh, the other reason why I picked this is that everything is the same color. And that's because terracotta refers to the kind of clay that the Chinese emperor, first emperor of China, used 
to construct every single one of his warriors. So they're all made out of the same color clay. Now supposedly they found trace elements of paint on them. So when they were actually new and freshly buried in these gigantic pits for China, the China uh, Emperor to have a full army for his afterlife, they were probably really painted vivid colors. But we just see them now after thousands of years in the ground as the actual color of the clay which is kind of a brown tan. So if you have brown you can use brown. All of this should be the same color. Now what I'm doing is I'm going ahead and coloring my figures. I did my foreground now I'm doing my middle ground and I'm doing them all the same color that I had in my crayon box. I think this is tan. If you don't have tan, you can use just a brown crayon and, and color lightly. Because once I've colored, and these are the background warriors, I'm not even going to bother with faces on them because they're all moving away. And there were thousands of these buried in a pit, gigantic pit in China for the emperor to have his afterlife. Plus, he had horses and chariots and musicians and acrobats and everything he thought he would need for his afterlife. So, once I've done it all one color, then I came back and I just used my brown and went over my lines again, which you can do, you don't have to, but it just adds another dimension to making everything kind of pop a little bit better. And I did this on, wherever there was a black line, I just went over it with my brown crayon. And just a line, you're not coloring, you're not double coloring, you're just kind of re-emphasizing the lines that you've already drawn. So I did that on my figures, all the way up. And there is no right or wrong way, there's no mistakes in art. And then I just did a little brown curve line on my background fading away figures. Then once I got done, I took my purple and I did a light loop-de-loop -loop line. Now I wanted it to not be distracting to the figures, but I did want to add a little bit of color. Blue I thought might be too much like outdoors, and they're not outdoors, they're in these giant pits. Black is too dark, so I thought, okay, I'll use purple. All right, let's see what this looks like all colored in. Okay, here are my terracotta warriors, all ready to help the first emperor in China. These were discovered in 1974, and they're still excavating the pits. So it's pretty impressive what he decided to take with him in his afterlife. Okay, bye-bye.